Today is a momentous historic occasion for the proud people of planet Bazuna. Today we launch our latest exploratory mission to uncharted space. We have the utmost confidence in our crew of elite scientists. We trust that they will see this mission through with dignity and honor, for they are the most brilliant and distinguished minds Pozuda has to offer. Farewell, brave explorers. You shall be our representatives to countless unknown worlds. We wish you safe travel, and may the light of the continuum shine upon you. All crew should report to the cryostasis sleep pods to begin the initiation of automated launch. Please look into the light to enter the cryosleep combination. Yes, sir, Captain Flax. You are hereby ordered to report to the bridge immediately to get ridiculously drunk with me. <laughs> yes, sir, yes, sir. <laughs> Today is a proud, momentous occasion for the proud people of Posey. <laughs> Dude, you sound just like him. I can't believe we pulled this off. <laughs> So, where do you want to go first? Well, I've been having some, some thoughts about that. I am already way too drunk to be navigating this vessel, and I know you're in a similar position. So I was thinking we should wake somebody up and get them to be our designated navigator. It's the responsible thing to do. All right, all right, I, I agree, and I, no, just the who, how to do it. Right. Oh, seriously, her? Look, CR was the best navigator on Pazuda. She was top of her class at the Space Academy. No, no, come on. This is supposed to be a guy's night. Why would we want to ruin it by going and waking her up? I mean, I, she's... Oh, I get it. You want to blarg her. I do not want to blarg her. I mean, I totally would blarg her, but... Drek, that's not... I get it. She's hot. But there are literally octillions of other life forms out there in the galaxy just waiting for us to dock in their bays, man. Well, I want to get to know her better, okay? No, no. There's no way we're waking her up. Laser phaser blaster for it? <sighs> Fine. Laser phaser blaster pew. Laser phaser blaster pew. Laser phaser blaster pew. Ah, blaster beat phaser. All right, you win, lover boy. But if she blarks this up, I'm holding you responsible. Good morning, Ziora. Are we there already? No. Uh, what? what? We're not going to... Front and Aloise system, then why are you waking me up? You see... Wait! Was there a malfunction? Did the hull breach? Do we need to get down to engineering and no, check on that? Nothing like that. She was fine. And what the corp is going on? Why did you wake me up? See... I'm maybe sort of... have a surprise for you. A surprise? Attention crew, this is your new captain speaking, Captain Flax. <laughs> Our original mission has been cancelled. We will now embark on a non-stop planet hop in search of inebriation and fornication. 
All crew members currently sleeping in stasis pods are instructed to remain sleeping. Commander Drek, Lieutenant Ziora, report to the bridge at once to party! Woo <laughs> Surprise! that's out of the question, Lieutenant Ziora. You see, Drek and I have just broken a long list of protocols. Exiting a stasis pod before the scheduled time, hijacking a Class 9 Federation starship, drinking in the workplace, and so on. And since Drek Blarking insisted that we bring you along... Actually, I beat him at least. That, uh, that means that you're an accomplice. Guilty by association. There's no put turning back now, Z. And don't worry about any of the scientists finding out. I've got a plan to get us back on the original course without anyone knowing who lies in it. Fine. So where do you want to go, Captain? <laughs> That's the spirit, Z. All right. Show us every nearby planet with atmosphere. Roth 401, Class B planet, home of the Intergalactic Revenue Service. Oh, that sounds so boring. Somewhere fun, somewhere fun. Palladia 21, ooh, Class B planet. Their main export is high fashion nail polish. They have so many colors. No. Fine. Uh, Perxion X52. Oh, no, 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 nobody likes Zognoids. Come on, Ziora, these are terrible suggestions. When I said a planet with atmosphere, I meant party atmosphere. Wait, 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 go back. Earth, home of the most intoxicated species in the galaxy? You don't want to go there. It's Class D, a real dive planet. This is ridiculous, Siora. <laughs> All of these are terrible. You're not even trying. I want to find a planet with alien women, with foxy alien women. The foxier, the better. Why didn't you say so? Zerda 9, Class A planet. 89% of the population is female, and none of the inhabitants ever wear clothing because their society never developed a shame for nudity. Said to be the foxiest planet in the universe. Oh, this could be fun after all. No, why does it hurt?